Hello everyone. Well, <clears throat> hello everyone. Welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. As you can see, there is a cover on the well, and this little stand here was removed also. I didn't participate in this. I was I was down at the in the Azola pits uh, digging a drain this morning, and I got too hot. I, I, didn't stay hydrated. It took me a couple hours. I was just trying to, I dug a ditch to drain uh, so the water would, would drain out from underneath the tarps. And I got too hot. I got a headache. I still have a headache. I came in right before lunch and just uh, took some ibuprofen and laid down. And um, Tata and Nerio did this right after lunch, and so I, I was not uh, privy to anything that they did here, but uh, this will suffice. It's just a uh, removable cover, I would assume. Yeah, it's not, it, it's just, it's heavy enough to where uh, little kids couldn't uh, lift it off and it's strong enough to where any little kids you got on top of it would not be able to to bust through it so that's complete i was going to use the the i don't even want you the, the steel panel like what we used on the outside of the of tatai shop but it would have taken more than one, and we only have one, so they just did it this way. Tata and I talked about that this morning. So it's complete. Uh, no more dogs can get into it, and certainly uh, not any children. You know, red's the only one good thing about having uh, close to 20 dogs here is there aren't any little wandering neighbor kids. They just come around for a visit or they're, they're just, you know, playing around here. So I'm not that concerned about kids falling into the either this well or the one down there because no one creeps around on this property without uh, at least a barking assault from these dogs. So I'm, I was never, I'm still not ever worried about uh, any of the kids falling into any of these wells because Red's terrified of these wells and I and I kind of helped that along he uh, doesn't go anywhere near them so um, not that big of a deal about any kids ever falling into them but um, the dogs you know that's a different story they're not they're not afraid at least uh, sugar wasn't and I have seen black up here walking on the edge of this so and we just lucked out that when she landed down there she didn't hit anything she didn't hit the wood that's there and uh, she only hit water I would assume since she didn't have any abrasions or broken bones and she was able to swim up to the surface and haul herself out with the wood that's down there but uh, might not be so lucky the next time so it's a good thing to to get these covered and with the well down there, the, the big new well, it still does have those bamboo uh, cross uh, brace points in it. So pretty much the same thing. Anything falling in that could haul themselves out on those or stand on them if it was a person that fell in there. So it's done. It's good. Good enough. Enough? Yep, it's enough. It's also our Malabi. Oh, it's Malabi? Yeah, the big Malabi. Okay. Well, it's not like we don't have plenty of wood laying around. I put, I mean, I put a uh, metal paring, but uh, don't really... Step through it? Step there. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, that's fine, Tata. That's fine. I put a uh, metal. Alrighty then. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, Please share, and subscribe. Name.